Okay, there's something I wanted to show you all <clears throat> how to use. I'm at the vehicle shop and if you download this trailer it'll be under miscellaneous but it's the Flegel animal trailers there's a pack comes in the pack so I have this one here it will pick up your pigs beef chicken and lamb for you if you purchase the animals in game uh, you can see the prices here we're going to do a uh, chicken right quick like so uh, it shows 120 you can still purchase some this away but if you use this trailer if you purchase them you can see the prices are uh, significantly cheaper and the market is just right next door here this is it to the right to the vehicle shop I was going to put this uh, mod in the uh, states map but I did not so uh, it's turning radius on this truck it's never a time with this trailer the gate will open back up now you see we what we just got in our F1 menu chickens are only $20 a piece if you purchase them this way uh, again here they're 120 so uh, let's load up some chickens and then I'll show you what I changed at the uh, chicken brawler to uh, make more sense about unloading these things. The triggers were actually inside so I had to do a little work on them. Not much but uh, I'll pause this while we load up these chickens and uh, we'll haul them over to the uh, chicken barn. Okay we're loaded up. This trailer holds 140 although uh, trailer this size should probably hold a thousand or more. Uh, we're going to drive over. And this is a rather long drive. So again, I will pause the video, but just for the sake of knowing, this is where I'm heading, down here in the south west corner east of uh, field 29 so I will just pause this until I get there just in case you wanted to just see a little bit of the map stuff you've already seen We're almost, well, by the time you see this video, the map will be finished because all I'm doing now is testing the final export of this map. I was able to get it down to just below 600 megabytes, maybe just a little bit above, but roughly 600 megabytes. It loads really quick and that's something I've been careful on uh, the mods that I've added like I said originally I did have the universal process kit in here with the uh, fuel biodiesel things like that it seemed a little bit laggy so you can download those placeables all you want to Unless uh, something changes, I probably will wait a while before I uh, put them in here. 
So, er, uh, I'll just head to the uh, far end and uh, try and keep this as quick as possible. The original version of these masks you would load on the inside the trigger was a little bit uh, finicky so to speak so I moved the trigger out here uh, back up to the gate and we'll unload them there maybe I can back this one up better Should get the gate open the trigger. Oh, we did. Open the gate. Well, uh, I got, actually got the unload trigger first. But, but there it goes. Uh, we'll let the gate, you don't want to let the gate open before you drop the rear door if you, that's what you want. But uh, we'll look in this Uber NAS to see. How many? I believe I'm at number one. Uh, we don't have anything, so let's, let's get some in there. And there they go. You'll see them start to appear inside the chicken houses. though they're in crates, but this is number one, I believe, yep, they're already loading up, or unloading, so you will still have to load, load on the inside, but to unload them, you can do it outside, which in all aspect, I believe that little gate right there was only there so you can get a skid steer in because the, the, remember the first one had the manure being inside, about all you could unload it with was the skid steer. These 5.0 versions, it was actually outside. I put uh, conveyors by them. So the, the next biggest thing for this would be the actual move the unload trigger outside also so the only reason you would need to go inside is to feed them grain and straw and of course you just put the water here and your earth fruits here potatoes and sugar beets so that's how you will unload your chickens this time around and hope you like the video and I uh, hope you like the map the map is very large I've started uh, planting, uh, playing it some, just doing some final checks, but at the same time, it's a very big map, and I encourage you to just pace yourself and try to have fun with it, and it does play a multiplayer, and from what I understand, it's been playing pretty smooth for the person that's uh, been testing it. So, uh, thank you.